Cave divers have discovered the eerie underwater grave of an ancient woman with a deformed skull who lived on the Yucatan Peninsula around 10,000 years ago. This discovery making her one of the earliest known inhabitants in Mexico. Traditionally, scientists thought only a group of humans crossed a land bridge connecting Asia to North America around 12,000 years ago. But synchro caves in the Yucatan Peninsula have yielded nine other skeletons, including a teenage girl linked to modern Native Americans. That suggests humans had already reached that far south by roughly 12,000 years ago. Back in 2016, explorers discovered ancient female skeleton known as Chan Ho Tree while mapping a cave in the Yucatan Peninsula. The skeleton had tooth cavity, indicating a high sugar diet and believed she died around 30 years of age. Her cause of death is unknown but from analyzing the skull, she did suffer three skull injuries in her life, all of which it covered. She also had crater shaped deformations on her skull that looked like they were caused by a bacterial infection, like syphilis. Experts are speculating that she may have been expelled from her group and was killed in the cave, or was left in the cave to die. A more detailed analysis of the skull revealed that it was a round skull with a lower forehead. It was one of the two groups of skulls found in Mexico, and the other was longer. That suggests two human groups is probably with different looks and cultures, but they coexisted in Mexico around 12,000 to 8,000 years ago. A striking feature of the part of the Yucatan Peninsula is a large complex of submerged cave and sinkholes. Thousands of years ago, these cave and sinkholes served as shelters, and only later did they become inundated. To date, archaeologists have discovered 10 human skeletons in this underwater cave, including the newly discovered Chan Ho Tree.